5. Paint me like one of your crypto girls. Back in 2015, a Twitter user going by the name of at coin artist created The Legend of Satoshi Nakamoto. This was a puzzle consisting of a painting which, if solved, would reveal the secret key to a wallet holding 4.87 Bitcoin. However, if you looked up the wallet address known as 1flemin6, you could see that those 4.87 Bitcoin are still there. But what's odder is that the wallet suddenly contained 5 Bitcoin. So. How did this happen? This mystery goes deep, too deep for one video, and if you're curious, follow the link below for the whole winding tale. Four. The Bulgarian Job According to the Selic, more than 200,000 bitcoins were seized by Bulgarian authorities last year in an operation against criminals within the Selic, who had been manipulating corrupt customs officials in order to install a virus that would allow criminals to remotely verify different imports. Over 100 bitcoin addresses were seized from 23 suspects. This confiscated bitcoin, valued at over 3 billion, was enough for the Bulgarian government to dig its way out of a fifth of its debt. However, despite pressure, officials refused to declassify the public addresses of these wallets so that there might be some oversight. After curiosity and speculation brought enough attention to these confiscated bitcoins, the head of Bulgaria's specialized prosecution office announced that no bitcoins had been confiscated and blamed the Selic for making a false claim. There are many theories as to what could have happened to these bitcoins, or if there were as many as were initially reported. What do you think happened to Bulgaria's bitcoin stash? Three. The Fudcoin Conspiracy This Bitcoin mystery is one that takes the idea of lax government regulations to a dark place. This is the idea that all of cryptocurrency is a government experiment to bring the world's money into a fully government-controlled digital economy. That's right, kiddies. Just like LimeWire, Pinterest, and Angry Birds, your free and open Bitcoins were developed by the government for the government. The logic goes something like this. Governments have allowed cryptocurrency to flourish suspiciously unhindered in order to allow citizens to become familiar and more trusting with the use of digital money. Once the world is hooked and everyone is using it, they crash the system through brutal legal reforms and leave the world with no other option than to convert what remaining currency they have into government-backed cryptocurrencies. What do you think? Is the Fed coin coming? Or is this just some more FUD coin? Two. Beelzebub's Bitcoin. That is right, the ultimate FUD. Bitcoin is the currency of hell, a literal mark of the beast. To understand where this theory has originated, we must go back, way back, to Revelations 13:17, And that no man might buy or sell, save he that had the mark, or the name of the beast, or the number of his name. In this, the most out there of the mysteries we found, it implies that mass adoption will be the path to hell on earth. There have already been cases where people have implanted chips in their hands, and there's a strip club in Vegas where strippers can now be tipped in Bitcoin using a tattooed QR code. So what do you think? Could investing in Bitcoin bring you somewhere even warmer than that Mai Tai laden tropical beach? 1. The Satoshi Files As the popularity of cryptocurrencies rise, the mystery of Satoshi Nakamoto may go down as the greatest mystery of our time. Was he a man? A woman? A team? A shadow government of lizard overlords? No one knows, but everyone has a theory. Everyone from the CIA to Elon Musk have been eyed as potential suspects. All we know is that Satoshi created the first blockchain database in order to solve the double spending problem for digital currency and wrote the Bitcoin white paper in 2008. Then, after two years of anonymous communications with Bitcoin's original core team, Bitcoin went live and he vanished with one million Bitcoins. I just believe that somebody put that fictitious name. Satoshi Nakamoto. Some are adamant on their theories and some like Andres Antonopoulos believe that it doesn't matter who Satoshi is. It doesn't matter who Satoshi Nakamoto is. What do you think? Tune in next week for our top 5 wildest Satoshi conspiracy theories. We hope you enjoyed our top 5 Bitcoin mysteries. Please don't forget to subscribe and share and let us know if you've heard any crazy Bitcoin mysteries in the comments below.